Hey, marine biology students, it's Mr. Spam. And today's animal of the day is a fun one. It's very cute, and you may have seen it. I think it's at the Newport Aquarium, and it has a name that you won't forget. Actually, a couple names, but one that is very common. So let's talk, talk about it. It's one of my favorites. It's the jackass penguin, or Sveniscus demersus. Also called the African penguin, that's probably more of the common name, but this is an acceptable common name for it too, um, because its sound is much like a donkey. So that's where the name comes from. It's also called the African penguin. It's the only um, bird of its kind that, that actually nests in Africa. Um, you're gonna find a lot of them in South Africa, um, southern part of Africa. Um, these guys are part of the bandit penguins, related to some of the other penguins that are in South America. Um, they're foragers, they're, they're pretty much generalists, so they eat a lot of fish, a lot, a lot of anything they can get their hands on, or their beaks on, I should say. Um, and they're, they're pretty unique in their, um, I guess, their biology, being the only penguin in this area of, of Africa. Um, they do um, have um, basically a unique, unique in the animal kingdom, I guess, um, way of caring for their young, the, the, the eggs laid. Um, and one of the birds will guard the egg and the other will go out feeding. Um, they will mate for life. And um, it's, it's a pretty good use of parental care. They don't have that many babies, so they have to they use their energy for caring for that one egg so they make sure it can last. As opposed to other animals that they might have lots and lots of eggs and they don't do parental care because they figured someone's gonna survive. Why should I waste my energy um, caring for them? So it's, all, it's pretty much, a, um, a, a numbers game. They have less, they lay less, so they have to, they have the parental care. Um, their biggest, I guess, um, worry is being eaten by sharks, by killer whales. Um, those, those kinds of um, animals will definitely eat them a lot, especially in South Africa. Um, they are considered threatened, um, mostly because of overfishing. The overfishing usually catches the fish they like to eat, so if they don't have any food, that's gonna threaten them. Um, humans have taken over a lot of their habitat. Um, it's just one of those kind of sad situations. Oil spills are terrible. Imagine swimming down and getting some food and then coming up and they're, you're covered by oil. That's going to make you really heavy and not be able to swim as well or definitely get back on land possibly. So these are some big time human impacts. There is some protection for them, but a lot of, a lot of times that protection doesn't really cover things like overfishing and, and things like that. So. Definitely a species of concern, um, something that we definitely want to protect, a unique bird for sure, and that is our marine animal of the day. So I hope you enjoyed it. You guys have a great day, and I will see you back again tomorrow with another one.